I have a tough question for you. A very tough question for you. Alam mo na ba ang purpose mo sa mundong to? Hi, welcome to Adrian Milag, Vlog of Inspiration. Alam mo, isa sa na-realize ko that hindi mo na nakilan ng, um, ng science or, or something uh, uh, highly intellectual for you to discover your purpose. I truly believe this that hindi ka lang aware maybe hindi ka lang aware but along the way but I know that meron ka ng idea kung ano ang purpose mo. How Ano yung mga bagay na gusto, gusto mo gawin? Ano yung mga bagay na nag -e enjoy ka na gawin? Ano yung mga bagay na gusto mong gawin kahit na hindi ka binabayaran? Ano yung mga bagay na iniisip na kinikilig ka? Naiisip mo pa lang na yung, 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 ganun tumatalon na yung puso mo that, that, that you are so excited about on doing that. Ano yung mga bagay na yun? I know in a fact, Joe, I'm sure na alam mo na yun. I'm sure na meron ka na konting idea about it. Or maybe, alam na alam mo na ang purpose mo sa mundo ito. You know, if you all already know the answer to my question, God, wants you to use it to bless the world. Yes. Gusto ng Diyos na gamitin mo yung purpose mo na yan to bless this world. To bless this dark, ano man, yung, yung, yung dark, this dark world that, that needs light and that purpose will give light to those people that are hopeless. Those purpose will give life to those people that are experiencing death. That purpose will give also purpose to those people that has no purpose in life. You know, God gave you that unique purpose to bless the world. God made you for that certain purpose for you to fulfill and God wants you to bring out that purpose to bless the world alam mo na um, nakakalungkot lang kasi meron mga tao na tumanda na sila nasa 50s, 60s na sila or even in, in, in their own deathbed hindi pa rin nila wala Why? Because they never seek, they never ask, they never um, try to discover, they never take risk, they never try, they never take action for them to know their purpose because they are contented on their comfort zone. At ayoko mangyari sa'yo. Because, you know, this world needs you. This world needs your purpose because this world um, wants you to fulfill that purpose because that purpose will bless many lives that purpose will, will will save many people's souls that purpose can lead those people closer to Jesus and for me dati tiyatanong ko din sa sarili ko na ano Lord ano ba yung purpose ko para sa mba ko Kasi alam mo, dumating ako sa point that I feel that I'm insignificant. I feel that I'm worthless. Feeling ko hindi ako talented. Feeling ko wala akong kwenta. Feeling ko I'm, I'm just small like this. But you know, God led me. God 
gave me the right people, the connection, the resource that I need nung simula kung pinuksong ko yung sarili ko na namadiscover ko yung purpose ko. And right now, I discover my purpose in life. And I became a preacher, God. Uh, ginawa pala ako ng Diyos to be to communicate God's love, to communicate God's um, ano yun, God's words to other people. And ginawa pala ako ng Diyos na maging online marketer. Ginawa pala ako ng, ng Diyos na mapunta sa sales. Ginawa pala ako ng Diyos na maging blogger. Diba? Ito, gumag to, 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 to write a blog, to, 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 to make this video, to, to bless those people na kailangan ang message na to. And right now, God is is, is telling you this word that this word, this, this, this broken word, this, this dark word needs your light, needs that purpose that God wants you to fulfill. Will you take that action to step out and fulfill that purpose? I hope this video blog inspire you a lot and if you want more tips and inspiration from me all you need to do is visit my website at www.adrianmilag.net So again this has been Adrian Milag I'm praying for you always God bless you more abundantly bye